In this video, is I want to explain about what is the difference between the two pin rocker switch and the three pin rocker switch. So basically, these two is a switch will make it on and off, but there is a three pin and a two pin. So the important is this switch is we handle for how many ampere. So we have to see in the body of the switch here. So here is written for 6 ampere, 250 volt. So same goes to this we handle for 6 ampere, 250 voltage. So both uh, the purpose is to make it on off. <clears throat> so what is the difference between these two and the three? The two pin is basically a very simple. We make it on off for one appliance. You want to identify this switch is either is good or bad. You can just use multimeter. So you can select to the buzzer mode. So this is connectivity. So a good switch will be have connection. So this is the on mode. This is off mode. On, off, on, off. So this is a good switch. And how about this? So this switch, this side is on, off, on, off. So the difference is this side will be on and this side will be off. So one side on, one side off. One side on, if I turn on here, then this side off, this side will be on. So this will be all right. So when this side is on and this side is off, when this side is off and this side will be on. So this is two way rocker switch. So all the power ground will connect to the ground, neutral will connect to the neutral and life we supposed to have connection to the life but in between here this two pin switch will be here so this switch so here's the two pin switch once you press once you press then the contact will be on and the light will be turned off so when you turn on this switch, there will be this position. When you press this side and this switch will be turned on and this is turned off. If you press this side and this side will be turned on and this side is turned off. So this position, the three pin switch, you can control two light bulb. But only for, but two pin switch, we only control only for one light bulb. So uh, I'm going to make it for demonstration so basically this is 240 volt uh, AC power and here's three pin plug and here's life and then neutral and a ground so I'm going to connect to the power point and this is 240 volt light bulb so here is uh, life neutral and a ground so the ground we connect to the ground here we must turn off the switch first. It's ground. Ground is ground here. And the neutral. We connect to the neutral here. Make sure that you handle with very careful because this is 240 volt. This can kill us. In here, this is a neutral. So neutral I already make for power if I directly connect to the connector here and if I turn on the main switch and this light bulb will be turned on right so this is we control the switch for the main power source I will turn off first and here I remove this and this simple connector And now we have extra cable here. 
So I will use this is two pin switch. The two pin switch we connect to the connector here, and uh, you can make it input either here or here because this is just two pin. So I will make it input from in the middle one. And then this will be connect to output to the light bulb. Right, so if I turn on the power source from the main uh, switch here, okay, now the light is turned off because this switch is off mode. So be careful that don't touch the pin anymore. So I'm using the slave here. <laughs> So on, off, on, off. So this two pin switch, we only make it on off for only one light. So I will turn off the main switch and I will remove. If I use this 3 pin switch, I will make it as on off for only one light bulb. So we connect to in the middle pin and we off from this side and one pin. I'm not going to use one pin. So this time I will make it on off for one light bulb and I will turn on the main power source. So on, off. On, off. So, if you plan it to make it on off for only one appliance, you can just use only two pin. If you don't have a two pin switch, you can replace to use three pin. It does not matter. Three pin, you can still use it for make it on off. But you must be very careful if you use three pin. Once you off. Then this side, now the current is already here. The voltage is already turned on this switch, uh, this pin. So you must uh, tape it or you must cover it up. Otherwise, this pin, there is the current, the voltage now. So you must not touch this pin anymore because this is 3 pin type. This is not really safety. But if in case your switch is just used inside the box, or the casing you can still use all right so i will turn off first i will turn off the main power and i will use extra one more light bulb using this two pin the neutral we directly connect to the neutral here and then the ground we connect to the ground here this pin we connect to one side of the switch here so this is the proper way to use how they design for the three pin switch. So this time I'm going to turn on the power source. So this light is turned on and this side is off. So if I switch this side is on, this is off. On, off. So this is the purpose that they use for the three pin switch left and right left and right right so i hope you understand how is the difference between the two pin switch and the three pin switch so I hope you like this video and please uh, help me to like and share my video and thank you for watching.